official of the Namibian National Olympic Committee is optimistic that the recent Dragon Boat Racing event for orphans and vulnerable children could lead to medals for Namibia at the international level in future. The race was part of a fun day organized by the Quinton Steel Boaters Cancer Fund for orphans and vulnerable children from various houses of safety in the capital. Secretary General Joan Smith, who was the guest of honor at the event, which took place on the dam at the Lodge east of Vintuk, told Nampa on the sidelines of the race that the event was long overdue because most, if not all, of the children who participated that day never had the opportunity to row a boat at all before. An opportunity for our children, and I can assure you that some of these boys and girls are already thinking of becoming rowers for Namibia in future. These are the events where we do talent identification. On behalf of the Olympic Committee, she gave her blessings to the Namibia Canoe Federation, which facilitated the dragon boat racing. More than 250 children above the age of 13 from Hope Village, Wilderness Therapy Namibia, SOS Children's Village, Marua Children's Home and the Namibia Orphanage benefited from the fun day. The event was also aimed at teaching them teamwork. Founder of Hope Village in Katatura, Pastor Mariki de Klerk, said the event had a big impact on all the children. We really need people to get involved with our children, not just women, but men, because they need role models. And it doesn't need to be something big. It can be an hour, once a month, every, once every two months. Invite them to your home, just go out with them for a cup of coffee or movie, and you won't believe the impact it will have on their lives. The day was made possible by various sponsors, like the Vintu Country Club Resort and Casino, Marathon Sugar, Coca-Cola, Awas Motors, Hyundai, Old Mutual, Starlight, and Dunlop Tires 2000. Since its humble beginnings in 2007, the QSB Cancer Fund has assisted 46 cancer patients from across the country.